Hey, shiny. Okay. Oh no. Everyone's something for, after from the me. Incident at the bank. Who gives a shit? I heard that you're heading to the city. Once you're out there, I want you to check one apartment for me. There's suspicion of domestic terrorism and corporate espionage, so expect a warm welcome. Should I assume hostility from the suspect? <laughs> I Probably. assume you'll find sensitive data there. Look for it thoroughly and make sure it comes straight back to my hands. Tenement across the street from the arcade, apartment 12. Now go, I've got to prepare for a meeting. And remember, if you won't take care of it, another cop will have to. Another cop that isn't quite as resistant to deadly surprises as you are. Probably still too steep. I think that car is hitting its tail uh, tailpipe. I'm still open. Okay, this is a bit sus. waiting for you upstairs. This entrance to the building is off limits. You have to use the staircase. Uh, okay. Do you think it's going to hold his weight? <laughs> Doesn't matter. Just don't jump it. Why he meet here? The old man's waiting. So, it's true what they say. You do have some kind of defect. Huh? Okay. Oh! It's good to see you, my boy. Leave us. I want to talk to him in private. You have to excuse me for not getting up. I'm in a rather unfortunate state. You did exceptional work at the bank. I want you to know that I am deeply grateful for your service to OCP and the city of Detroit. See, I grew up in this very apartment. Ah, or childhood home. It. it used to be a thriving neighborhood. Nothing like what you see right now. I always dreamt of turning it into the most prosperous district in the city, a new heart of Detroit. Can you imagine? Or do you think it's just an old fool's pipe dream? I agree with all city improvement plans that have the citizens' well-being in mind. Glad to know you approve. Delta City's construction is about to start. Finally, the old and frail will be replaced with the new and strong. Decay and death are terrible things. You lose everything you worked for your entire life. But I don't have to tell you 
what that's like. It really makes me wonder, has the time you spent in that armor been a burden to you? The enhancements allow me to excel in fulfilling my duty. Not only your actions, but your words confirm that you're an exemplary police officer. The real reason I've summoned you here is because I'm worried. I'm aware of your instability problems, and it's not a matter that we can overlook. Okay. That's why I've requested to have people look after you. Tell me. How are you finding your evaluations with Dr. Blanche? I am happy to comply with any activity that improves effectiveness. You're a good sport. I can imagine it's not a pleasant experience, but I can't express how much I'd like you to keep at it. I'm sure that becoming a liability is the last thing you'd want. Am I right? Hmm. That is correct. Now we've reached an understanding. Tell me, is there anything I could do to put your mind at ease? My fellow officers worry about OCP's intention regarding their work. Really? I'll have a word with Becker. Perhaps some new equipment would boost their morale. It would be appreciated. I have to say, you brought a lot of hope into this old man's heart. Now, excuse me. I'm not supposed to exert myself too much. <laughs> Doctor's orders. And you can't argue with them. I wonder if I should have, like, asked something for Louis. Can't, can't ask for two things. Take care of yourself. After all, the peace of Detroit depends on your well-being. and steel? Eh, go ahead. Just not where we live. Okay, so this was this was the area. Serve and protect. Okay, so there's more stuff I need to be look on the look for. And I need to get all of them. Are you alright? Smoking is dangerous, not to mention illegal. I don't give a shit about either. Then you must suffer the consequences. Eh, no one in this country values independent thinkers anymore. Smoking, smoking when <laughs> filling your your car tank. I wonder. Sure, I'm in the right place, but I can't see my FTO anywhere. Could I have his name, please? Over. Sure thing. It's Officer Rat. <laughs> they are hazing him up once again. Place he belongs, if you catch my drift. Over and out. Right. So much for my field training.
Officer Washington, Let's I will help be the your guy. field trainer for today, requesting readiness confirmation. Yeah, thanks for the offer, but maybe the others are right. I might not really be cut out for field work. Ask yourself, do I have the will to clean the streets of Detroit of unrighteous individuals? Yeah. As a matter of fact, I do. Officer Washington reporting for field training. Okay, that was easy. Good. You have your body armor on. Well done. What about the rest of your gear? Service pistol? <laughs> Good thing we uh, changed his ammunition. service pistol. Check. Duty light? Never part with it. Good job. Preparation is the most important. So is knowing your surroundings. Are you familiar with this area? Isn't this the part of the city where it gets really busy like all the time? Police! I think that answers my question. Please! I need your help! Set the radio to my channel and follow me. Roger that! An officer needs to be confident. Straight back, sturdy walk, together with a clear and unshaking voice. Officers, thank God you're here. I really need your help. What happened? You see that cat? When responding to a request for aid, the first thing is to introduce yourself to the potential victim. Watch and learn. I am Officer Murphy. How do you do, madam? Well, to tell you the truth... The second thing is to reassure the victim of their safety. Madam, you do not need to be afraid anymore. We are here to help you. Yes, but it's not about me. The third thing is... I'm quite familiar with the field training manual, so if you don't mind, I'll take over. <laughs> maybe maybe Ma he has better bedside manner. It's my cat, Fortune. Okay, He's it missing. is a cat. Fortune is my biggest treasure. I can't lose him. Do you have any idea where he might be? The only place I can think of is the basement. I've also heard some ruckus coming from downstairs today, but the lights aren't working and my eyesight's not so good anymore. Is it okay for us to investigate the basement? Yes, it makes an excellent opportunity for low light training. Let us proceed downstairs. Good luck down there. The cat has that name for a reason. He really brings fortune. So don't you come Turn back your without flashlight him. flashlight on. Right. Duty light can be advantageous, but it can also be a liability. Keeping it close to you creates a clear target for the violators. It is good practice to hold the duty light away from your body. I don't remember reading that in the field manual. Did you get it from a different book? No, from experience. Good use of, uh, well, expensive police equipment. He's looking around as well. I suppose this will end up in a shootout. Clear. Clear. Hey, I think I just saw the cat. You think I should try to remove these planks? Stand aside. Gosh, you are strong, ain't you? Let us get back on track. Sure thing. What was that? Jar. <laughs> okay. Ah, oh, man, I walked into a mess. And now my shoes are covered in strawberry jam. Yeah, <laughs> it, it was a suspect, strawberry. Do not rush headfirst. Take blind corners as wide as possible. 
cuts down on being surprised. Fugitive has left the trail. This time, pace yourself. Do not get out of breath during a foot pursuit. You will need stamina to engage the fugitive later. Yep, yeah, it, it, oh, it is a cat. Like he stopped by the spill paint can. Suspect might be intoxicated. I used to know these kids who gave their cat stomach medicine to make it loopy. Yeah. Is there a moral to that story? Cats are susceptible to substance misuse. Shh. I heard something. I think it's coming from the piano. Animal trace match. Get inside that piano. That must be hiding inside. Let me lure it out. Go ahead. There it is. It's escaping. Darn it. Come with. Come with me, dead or alive. Went through here, but that's a very narrow passage. Let's try the door. It's locked, but I can try to squeeze through that gap. Go ahead. Okay, here I go. It's actually not as bad as I thought. Cool. Now let me get that door open for you. Who would have thought that being small can actually have its advantages? An eager police officer with a small build is worth twice as much as a big slacker. Good work, Officer Washington. Thank you, sir. No, get, get here. What was that? I'm afraid this time it's a one-way street, Mr. Cat. But where are you hiding? In a cupboard. There he is. Oh, gosh, Fortune. You look a mess. You think he's all right? The cat is fine. You can take it back to its owner. I will clean up any remaining mess. Okay, see you soon. I wonder what else is here. Need to be vigilant. Yeah. For for that. Cranium wood, okay. It's Washington. Do you read me? Loud and clear, what is your status? Engage bridges location. Got it. Officer Washington. Sir. Keep cool. I am coming up to have your back. Normal police work.
Obviously you need the house. your status I'm here remain calm I am here ah oh, nice work that was tense I need a breather officer Washington your performance today was impressive thank you sir means a lot coming from you <laughs> good thing we yeah. issued he you him a be better fine. weapon it is only a superficial wound see I've told you that cat brings luck isn't this just wonderful okay return to the streets okay lady needs to clean up this place a bit Shot here, here, here. Okay, they, they were shooting from that direction. That's a plot spanner. So these are probably <laughs> shots that he shot. Oh. Kind of. Okay, so no back door to this place. So let's go. Enter the building. Domestic terrorists. Dear cat helper, stop feeding the cats in the basement. They shit all over the place. I think we know the suspect. Daddy, what was that? Go back to your room, sweetheart. It's just someone on the staircase. New cocaine drugs. Okay, so it was a trap. This week, storage bill, pick up cat food. That's a fishmonger statement. Okay. Doesn't seem like a terrorist. Old pizza box. Electronic components. Documents. Something here. Secret entrance. Make a way. Well, 
this more, looks more like it. Rentala invoice. Storage number, storage unit. Hmm. That's our boss. Hello. So OCP is ordering you to break into the apartment of a reporter they don't like? Any comment before I write a story on that? I am here to investigate domestic terrorism. OCP sent you to my safe house because they want to know what I have on them after the bank incident. I assume there is more if you cannot store everything here. Yeah. I found a rental bill for a locker in a storage facility. Oops. Make up your mind. First you let me go at the bank and now, when I'm actually starting to figure out what the OCP scam is all about, you show up and ruin this. Do you want to help OCP avoid liability? Your evidence is invalid if you obtained it illegally. I don't collect it for the court. I won't win against OCP there. It turns out I was right. That thing that OCP plans to do with charging residents of old Detroit with additional costs, it is a loophole. Okay. It will lead to the illegal expulsion of thousands of people if you help OCP silence me. Explain. Not so fast. I need to be able to trust you first. At the bank, you've proved that you are more than just a tool programmed to obey OCP, but now the stakes are higher. What is it that you expect? Since you're here, I fully expect someone from OCP to go and check my locker. I need to protect what's inside, but there's a meeting I need to keep an eye on. Too much depends on it. I will not be involved in the smuggling of contraband. There's nothing illegal about my request. I need only one box from there. The one with the inscription, Bakery on the Corner. The rest you can leave to OCP to pick up. I need to just spring clean my out-of-date documents anyway. <laughs> spring All cleaning. Once you secure the box. Yeah, well, the police can do, do that for you. Okay. Not really a domestic terrorism. Oh, my picture. Robot, human, else, friend or foe. Where? Hmm. Fake ID card, okay. Okay, so it was a safe house. Okay, that that's actually pretty big crime. At at least in you Finland it would an be. an act of vandalism. Yeah, did the guy from the poster send you? Compliance uh, actually, with yes. the law has no political affiliation. I will not issue a ticket at this time, but remember Dreams are difficult to build and easy to destroy. You know nothing about politics, but thanks anyway. Serve the public trust. Yeah, his his uh, prime directive is to fir first is to serve the public trust, whatever that means. Okay, this looks sus. Perhaps you have a hearing problem. The lady said no. Ah. You're, you're right. That is what she said, officer. I I've got to check my hearing aid. Thank you, Robo. That guy was giving me the creeps. Uh-huh. Protect the innocent. Storage facility. Like me? Are you a true environmentalist? Do you appreciate the majestic beauty of nature? And do you feel helpless knowing that every year more and more species are becoming extinct? Because let's face it, there's nothing that can be done. So, you know what they say, if you can't beat them, join them. 
Last chance safari. See all the endangered species before it's too late. Oh, no. Last chance safari is the largest collection of near extinct species on the planet. Oh, no. So hurry. Get them before it's too late. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah. Humor is very black in, the, in this in this game. Okay. But people oh, are not, not extinct. So what? We're just Charge, here, okay. enjoying the moment. Nothing suspicious. Right, officer? Shouldn't we give the fellas the signal? We should just shut up and smile like the exemplary citizens that we are. Sus. Fake ID card. Are you lost, officer? I can show you the exit if you want. Trouble with the lock. Uh, seems that I forgot the key, but, uh... You will tell your story at the station. Are you sure you have enough seats in your car to take us all? No, but I have enough bullets. If you do not come quietly, I will not need any. This is all! I'm pressing the wrong button here, so... They're shooting for real. That wasn't fun. Fake money. already seen elsewhere. Huh? Okay, it was up. health here, okay. Kinda too, took too many hits. Ah, oh, th this is the e exit. Okay, we can probably use this. I think this is clear now and we can we can continue. Painting scene elsewhere. Hmm. Cat food. Okay. Oh, she peerinated. I think that's all. Painting 
seen elsewhere. Hmm. Is it that I need to find the pair or something? I don't know. And documents. Suppose this place is clean. And we have soon we have a points to upgrade ourselves. So maybe the vision would be a good idea. Well, well, well. Looks like Mr. Becker was right. You're up to something behind his back. These things are supposed to go to Mr. Becker, I reckon. What will interest Becker is in locker number 17. The contents of this box are none of OCP's concern. I'll have to tell Mr. Becker that you have not given us all the material. I assure you that it will end up worse for you than for me. I'm guessing you have my stuff. Did OCP arrive at the party? They tracked my location. Because they trust you so much. Speaking of which, the box. What if I lied about it? Did you ever think of that? There may be a bomb inside or the head of my sworn enemy. Do you want to know what's inside? If there is evidence of a crime, I would like to know it. Police officer, first and foremost. In the box are my personal belongings. Letters, memorabilia, things that actually matter to me. When you become too tough to hit directly, the scum will try to get to you through your loved ones. I understand. So we have even more in common. Once OCP takes care of my old documents, I'll have the space to deal with the Delta City issue and help the people of old Detroit. You've helped them already, though. Thank you. Ronnie's Grocery. Leave the box there. Ronnie's closer. Okay. So it, it wasn't crime related. At all. Not too surprised though. I have Samantha's belongings. Ah, uh, yes. I'm glad you're helping her. Without that girl, OCP would put us all on the street still might. They did a number on a lot of families, hers included. Samantha's mother took it worst. But that's not a story for me to tell. Anyway, uh, leave the box in the back, next to the cat food. She's supposed to pick up everything tomorrow. Loops. Frequent consumption will cause dia diabetes amongst children. Oh no. 